Okay. JS Films is in Blender. This could only mean one thing. <laughs> so here we are in the same scene that we checked out roughly seven months ago with, I think, eight RTX 4090s or something like that. Well, in this video, we're going to be testing out eight RTX 6080s, which is the new graphics card from NVIDIA. All right, so this is the barbershop scene, which is one of my favorite sample demos for Blender. And let's get started, all right? So first things first, let me go to edit preferences and we're gonna be using optics in this one. Now, you can argue with me all day about CUDA and optics, which one's faster. We're gonna be using optics with this one and just for the sake of sanity, I'm gonna disable CUDA. We have optics, I'm gonna enable one, okay? And the CPU is a Threadripper Pro 5955WX16 course. Okay, so closes out. So we're gonna be doing cycles, GPU compute, 2048 samples. Scroll down. We're gonna be doing 2560 by 1440p. I'm doing the same exact settings I did with the eight RTX 4090s. So if you wanna check that out, I'll put the link in the comments below if you wanna compare that performance to this one. I'm gonna click on our Blender scene right here and I'm going to press F12. Now, it's a little bit tricky. So Usually when it, whenever you press render in Blender, oh, that rhymes. it usually does a little bunch of BS first. So what I'll do is I have a stopwatch and I'm going to count when it actually starts rendering. So here we go, F12. So as you can see right here, it's gonna load a bunch of stuff, Geo, Geo, Cubo, it's loading all the static meshes. But whenever it flashes and actually starts rendering and sampling, that's where I'm gonna press Render like right now. All right, here we go. Boom. Two minutes and 32 seconds, 12 micron. So let me pull up my RTX notepad. And we're going to write this down right now. One GPU equals... Two minutes, 32 seconds, sad face. All right, so this is 1440p cycles. All right, that's enough. Close that out. And now let's party. Optics, boom. Thrive, fear, foom, see, set, wheat. I don't know if that's a real number. Here we go. Closes out. I'm not changing anything here. It's the same exact one. Go to Blender, reset my timer, and press F. 12. This is now with eight GPUs. And I'm going to pull up again the task manager so you can see how this is going to work. All right, geometry. Boom. Let's start. All right. Again, similar to our NVIDIA Omniverse video, all of the GPUs are being utilized to 100%. 90%, 100%. Again, somewhere in Europe, you're probably gonna see some flickering lights because that's where all the machine is at. It's not here locally because I don't want that power bill. Boom, ladies and gentlemen, 22 seconds and 24. Path trace cycles at 1440p, 2048. All right. But again, this is JS Films and render boxes. I'm so fucking sorry, but we have to try this in 4K. It, it, there's just no going around this, man. All right, so here we go. I'm not even going to try one GPU with 4K because that we would be here for seven business days. 3840 by 2160. And just a disclaimer, dear, don't try this at home with your Intel GPU. All right, just don't try this at home, man. I don't want people to have their house burnt. All right, so we go 4K Ultra HD, 2048 samples. Let's render this baby and see how fast it goes. F12. 4K beauty. Starting now. And let me pull up the task manager again. All right. Render is finished. 47 seconds. 
47 seconds to render 4K cycles from 1440p to 4K, same samples per pixel, 47 seconds, ladies and gents. All right, so what I'm going to do is I'm going to do one more test, all right? Because this is me just really just being curious now. 47 seconds, okay? This is just crazy speeds. What I will do now is actually increase that samples per pixel, which is overkill for the scene. We all saw it. So I'm going to go back. And again, we have denoiser off because I don't denoise my renders. You all know that. What we'll do now is go to 4096 samples at 4K resolution. Oh my gosh. This is... Let's just do this. Let's, let's do this. I'm not going to say anything. F12. All right. We're starting now and we're pulling up that task manager. This is... This is a pretty extreme test, man. I mean... All right, a minute and 31. A minute and 31 seconds. All right, so let me just save this image because I want to pull it up. Here it is. So this is the so this is what it rendered 4K, 496 sounds per pixel in a minute and 30 in cycles. This is bananas, all right? So if you look at it right here, so now we're at like 4096, 2160p, 8 GPU, and you're running at a minute and 30, right? And what's interesting about this is with one GPU, with less resolution and less samples per pixel, we rendered two minutes and 32. This right here, a minute 30 per frame is still okay. That is definitely okay to me, right? Because that is 4K res, right? So that being said, that's pretty much it for this video. That is Blender 3.6 with 8 RTX 6000 ADAs in cycles in the barbershop scene. That being said, like always, please let me know what you think about this video and were you impressed with it? I was. Till then... I'll see y'all in the next one. Peace out.